you know, infantrymen get a really warped sense of humor. Um, we were, my platoon was left behind at a, uh, a burned over landing zone. And they couldn't get everybody out. Most of the company got out before nightfall, and so they left our guys uh, overnight uh, at this place where a helicopter had crashed and there had been a fight over the equipment, etc. You know, there's there's at least two good machine guns on every helicopter, right? right. And uh, there were skulls, and, you know, skeletons laying around there. So when we got uh, picked up the next morning, one of my friends brought a skull with him. And we went straight from the landing pad to the bar, to the EM club. And uh, this guy had a hit. His name was Richie. He had a really good sense of humor, kind of warped like the rest of us. And he set this skull on the bar, and it looked like it had three eye holes, right? Yes. And he said, two beers, one for me and one for my friend here. I just like, terrified poor little Bart. <laughs> <laughs> So we were left to uh, ten bar for ourselves. Um, guys who had not had a bath in probably three months. Um, we were pretty ripe, you know, yeah, and yeah. we just decided to have a party. Um, the party, you know, got broken up, so we had sat out in the rain and watched movies. The uh, movies they showed us were usually John Wayne cowboy and Indian things, and so you know we would always go and root for the Indians. Right. The Arvin guys thought the Indians were the Viet Cong, and it was just really goofy. <laughs> <laughs> you, you just you had to laugh at the situation. Right, right. Nuts. Yeah.